All right, uh, hello everyone. This video is about Google Analytics and in-page analytics. And I'm gonna show you exactly where to find it, assuming you have Google Analytics already installed on your website. All right. So let's get started. So here is my Google Analytics uh, account, and I'm going to take a look at this um, website called KillerGambit.com. It's a game review site, so check it out if you get a chance. So here's where you go. So once you're in here, you click on Content, and you want to select In-Page Analytics. Now, as this is loading, I'm going to tell you what this report is about. So this report will tell you, um, it'll give you a percentage of how many times somebody clicked on, you know, certain sections of your website within a uh, period of time. So up here, I've got a month's worth of information. And if you mouse over, do you see, it's going to up um, display your website. Now, if you mouse over, uh, you're going to see these little percentage signs uh, populate. So let's say, for example, we click on this sponsored one. So this one got 33% uh, click-through activity. So that means it got three clicks of the month that it was um, that it's been recording this information. So uh, again, go over here, go to the home. Okay, two clicks, um, and uh, you see this graphic here got two clicks also. So it's just a good way to be able to figure out, you know, what your user is doing once they land on your site. It gives you good um, analytical information about, you know, what buttons are working, what buttons are not. Maybe you want to, you know, do some sort of A and B testing. But this is uh, definitely a, a good, uh, uh, good statistical information that uh, Google Analytics is providing you on how your in-page links are doing once a user visits your website. All right, thanks a lot, and I uh, hope this is uh, good information. Feel free to leave a comment below. Let us know if you're using in-page analytics and how you're using it to improve your metrics. Take care.